Good day dear students our lesson for today is all about Western orchestra and musical ensembles in the community. For our learning objectives, at the end of the lesson the students should be able to Describes the instrumental sections of the Western Orchestra MU6 TBIIID1. String family is the biggest section of the orchestra. The violin, viola, cello and double bass are the most common instruments in the string family. They are made of wood and usually carved into their characteristic curvy wooden body shape, which is attached to a wooden neck piece. They all have four strings that are attached to wooden tuning pegs on the headpiece located on the top of the neck. The strings are stretched over the body and neck of the instrument. The bodies of string instruments are hollow to allow the sound of the vibration to resonate. They produce sounds when their strings are being plucked by fingers or struck and bowed with a bow. The bow is made of wood and horse hairs. Musicians press down on the strings with their fingers of the left hand and draw the bow across the string with the right hand. As with any instrument, the smaller it is, the higher the pitches it plays, and the larger the instrument is, the lower the pitches it plays. The string family includes the following instruments. 1. Violin. It is the smallest and has the highest pitch in the string family. It is the leader and the heart of the orchestra. 2. Viola. It is a little larger in size and has slightly thicker strings than the violin strings. It produces a darker, thicker, and a lesser brilliant tone. 3. Cello. It has thicker strings than the violins and violas strings. It is played with a shorter and thicker bow. The instrument rests against the knees of the musician who is seated while playing it. 4. Double bass. It has the lowest pitch among the string instruments. Its strings, which are very long and thick, produce a deep sonorous tone. 5. Harp. It has 47 strings which are plucked with fingers and not bowed. It has 7 pedals to change the pitch of the strings. It consists of a triangular frame formed by a sound box, a pillar, and a curved neck. Woodwind family. Instruments in this family all used to be made of wood, which give them their names. Nowadays, they are made not only of wood but also of metal, plastic or some combination. They are all tubes with an opening at one end and a mouthpiece at the other end. They each have rows of holes that are covered by metal caps called keys. They produce sound when the player blows air against a sharp edge or through a reed causing the air within its resonator to vibrate. Musicians play these instruments by blowing air through the mouthpiece and opening or closing the holes with their fingers to change the pitch. Below are instruments of the woodwind family. 1. Piccolo. It is like the soprano in the woodwind family. It is like a small flute and the sound is higher than the flute. 2. Flute. It is an aerophone or reed-less instrument. It produces sound from the flow of air across an opening creating rapid succession of tones. It is usually made of metal, although most flutes are made of woods. 3. Clarinet. It is a cylindrical instrument with a cup-shaped mouthpiece and a flaring bell at the other end. It is a single reed woodwind instrument. Its tone can vary from a low, to brilliant pitches. 4. Oboe. It is the most dramatic among the woodwind instruments and has a double reed mouth. Piece. It has a black which is normally made of wood. 5. Bassoon. It is called the clown of the orchestra because of the unusual often comic sounds it produces. It is the largest and the lowest sounding orchestral woodwind. 6. Saxophone. It has a cone-shaped body of brass with the lower end bent into a U-shaped design and usually comes in several sizes. Brass family. The brass instruments are made of metal. They are important in producing the loud, exciting parts of the orchestra. 
The instruments are also blown to create sounds by buzzing the player's lip against the mouthpiece. The brass instruments are lip-vibrated instruments. They produce sound from the vibration created by the musicians pressing their lips up against the mouthpiece while blowing. The vibration between the lips and the mouthpiece causes the air to vibrate down the long brass tube. Those tubes help the instruments to make different sounds. The buttons on the instruments are called valves. By pressing the valves, the player adds an additional length to the tube. Here are some examples of brass instruments. 1. Trumpet. It is the smallest main instrument of the brass family that produces the highest and brilliant sound. It is the leader and soprano of the brass family. 2. Tuba. It is the bass member of the brass family. It is the largest among the brass family with a mouthpiece and a big bell-shaped opening to a tube that is wrapped around in an oval. 3. French horn. It is the alto member of the brass family. It is 12 feet long and sounds mellow than the trumpet. It has a valve that is bent into a circle called rotary valves. 4. Trombone. It is the tenor member of the brass family. It is the only sliding instrument in the brass that uses a slide rather than keys. Valves are strings. Percussion family. Percussion instruments refer to musical instruments that produce sound by striking them with sticks or hammers, while others are through rubbing or shaking them against another similar instrument. The materials used to make percussions include metal, wood or plastic and they come in different sizes and shapes. They are used in accenting the rhythm and heightening the climax in the orchestra. Percussion instruments are divided into two classes, pitched and unpitched. Pitched percussion instruments produce notes with an identifiable or definite pitch. 1. Timpani. It is the loudest of all the orchestra instruments and requires tremendous precision of the timpanist. It can be played as both a rhythmic and melodic instrument. 2. Xylophone. It consists of wooden bars struck by plastic, wooden or rubber mallets. Each bar is tuned to a specific pitch of the musical scale. It produces wooden, bright rattling, shrill, hollow tinkling and clear sounds. 3. Glockenspiel. It is arranged like the xylophone but with a steel bell instead of wood. It is smaller in size than xylophone, and creates musical sounds that are higher in pitch. Unpitched percussion produces notes with unidentifiable or indefinite pitch. 1. Snare drum. It is played with a drum stick. It is used for roles in a classical setting or for adding accent to music. 2. Bass drum. It is a large drum that produces a note of low definite or indefinite pitch. It is used to keep a pulse in music. 3. Cymbals. They are used in pairs and consist of thin, normally round plates of various alloys. They produce sharp, clashing or crashing sounds. 4. Triangle. It has a triangular shape. It is played by striking with a stick. Thank you for watching in this video and I hope you learned something today, feel free to like share and subscribe for more educational content.